Hi, I'm 10 Tampa Bay Chief Meteorologist Bobby Deskins with a little deeper dive in wind shear and how that affects hurricanes. Now, this is a look at wind shear. It's the darker blues you see in here, and I put the arrows on so you can kind of see how fast the wind is going. Uh, you can see if we take it out into time, there's a lot of wind shear across the Gulf, parts of the Caribbean as well, too. Hurricanes do not like wind shear. Number one, if it tried to form in this area here, it would get blown apart. It would have a really tough time just forming a storm in that environment right there. If it was coming from down here and moving into an area where there's wind shear, it would tend to blow that storm apart. Here's what it looks like. So uh, the hurricanes are basically like a machine, right? There's lots of air going quickly around that eye wall and moving up and out. I know hurricanes have real low pressure, but did you know that above that, we like to have an area of high pressure higher in the atmosphere. That allows that air that's rising up in the center of those storms in the eye to get up and come out and spread out. That way the storm can keep growing. It can keep gra grabbing energy from that very warm water underneath of it. That would be a healthy storm. Now apply wind shear to that. Wind shear is essentially the change of wind speed or even direction with height. So you may not have a lot of wind down here, but the higher the storms go up in the atmosphere, they run into this really quick wind. That's wind shear. That tilts the storm and the storm then cannot have that structure that it needs to maintain the intensity that the storm would like to have, obviously, to stay a, a, a powerful system. So wind shear for us is a good thing, right? Because it will weaken these storms. Now, the one thing about wind shear is if you're on the right side of that storm, the storm may weaken, but it will likely blow most of that weather, clouds and a lot of rain and some wind, to the right side of that storm. And if you're there, you would get some of that. Stay informed, prepared, and connected with 10 Tampa Bay during hurricane season and every day. Watch us on your phone. Just download our app, stream us on your TV, and you can even watch live newscasts on 10tampabay.com.